The Mosque of Al Faf 1338H, 1920. This mosque is situated in the street behind the Royal Palace of Abdon and it projects beyond the boundaries of the palace gardens. It used to be known by the name of Abdin Mosque, after the name of its founder, Abdin Bey, Amir al-Liwa, as Sultani, commander of the Sultan's bodyguard, who founded it in 1141 h. 1728 29 All that remained of the mosque was its minaret and entrance. The rest was restored by order of the late King Fuad, at the beginning of the year 1336 h. Beginning of 1918, the Department for the Preservation of Arab Monuments prepared a project for the work and executed it. On completion of the work, the late King Fuad kindly inaugurated the restored mosque, performing in it the Friday prayers of 6th Rajab, 1338H. The 26th of March 1920. The mosque has two entrances, one of which is a private royal entrance, accessible only from the gardens of the palace. Facing this entrance is a rewak preceded by a portico on marble columns, whence a corridor, roofed with small domes, leads directly to the mosque. The interior of the mosque occupies a square area of about 17 meters a side. It is covered with a large dome, supported by four arches, resting on four columns of red granite, with decorated and gilded capitals. The four corners of the square are covered with four small domes. Great care has been shown in decorating the domes and the roofs. The drum of the main dome is surrounded by a beautiful band of inscription, comprising a verse from the Quran, the name of the late King Fuad, and the date of completion, 1338h. The walls are lined with a dado of colored marble. In the center of the Qibla wall is a mihrab, also lined with colored marble, with a beautiful marble minbar next to it. The floors are paved with colored marble with a beautiful geometrical design. The lighting arrangements in the mosque have been well designed, they comprise a huge brass lamp, pierced with beautiful designs, which is suspended from the summit of the main dome, by means of brass chains. Other small lamps are suspended under the arches. 